Hello again, this is Renee with Mommy for Five Griffins. And welcome back to my channel. If you're new, please subscribe. I have several different things that I work on each week. Um, today, I've been doing a little research on how to do the stairs. Um, the stair stickers are so expensive. Uh, the, the ones that you see there are like $58 for just 12 I don't know about you, but I need 15 uh, stickers for my risers. So, my plan was to get some contact paper. And, of course, you know, to DIY, you know, um, I got contact paper. And I um, paid $5.99 for the roll. Much better than the $58 just for 12 I would have had to buy two so yeah well, we're gonna do this way and see how it turns out right now I'm just measuring my stairs and as you notice the bottom stair is a little rounded so it's a little difficult so the measurement is obviously gonna be a little different than the others so I'm just measuring all my stairs to make sure I can make the cuts correctly it's very simple these are the items that you're going to need you're going to need contact paper I got the 18 inch by 20 um, 18 by 20 feet yes and a tape measure a marker a razor knife and some scissors that's all you need for this project it's very simple this is a super super easy project and it's very economical and as you know with contact paper you know it's very renter friendly this is something that you could do in a house that you rent or a house that you own if you get tired of it you just peel that baby back and redo it or if you're moving just peel them off and get your deposit hey And now I'm just applying my measurements to the, con the back of the contact paper. And the contact paper was so easy to do the measurements because of the grids. The grids make it super, super simple. So I basically just marked the line and followed the grid all the way across. How simple is that? By the way, I got this uh, contact paper from Amazon, and like I said, it was only $5.99 for a 20-foot roll. They had several different designs. My treads, well, not the treads, the risers. My risers ended up being um, approximately five and a half inches high. So this paper is 18 inches long so I just actually measured um, six inches and that gave me lots of space to work with so each 32 inches of paper I actually got three uh, risers out of each one so this process actually went very very quickly And in measuring um, my risers, I had three, well, I have two turns on my, on my stairs. So I actually have three different sizes. So the, the grids and everything made it super simple. If you're able to get contact paper, it's so much easier than dealing with wallpaper or, or, um, those expensive stair stickers I mean they're beautiful but come on I don't want to pay a, over a hundred dollars to do my stairs 
Okay, $5.99, it did the trick. And it looked great afterwards. My entryway is kind of dark, so the hardest part was actually trying to find where to start the, uh, the contact paper. But once I had that on there, it, it was so much easier. I just followed it along and I used an old credit card or any anything with a straight edge will, will help you smooth it out and smooth out any air bubbles. And if there's any overhang, that's no problem. Um, after you're done, what, what I did was I just used a razor knife after I was finished and cleaned it up, made sure there wasn't any um, ruffled edges or any overhang. But the peel and stick, it's very forgiving. So if you're not able to get it right the first time, just unpeel it and and try again it's it's fail safe actually Yeah, you see I'm just smoothing it out so everything is adhering well to the to the riser and smoothed out without any air bubbles. I actually found that it, it was pretty easy um, to get a good fit without a whole lot of air bubbles or creases. It actually worked really, really nicely. And I'm just going to go ahead and finish up all the other uh, risers uh, since you see you have the hang of it. And there we go. I just need to trim with a razor knife. And you see the little overhang. Yeah, I have to trim with a razor knife and um, finish it up. But this is how it looks. It actually looks really nice. And there's a second turn in my stairs like I was telling you. There, there's a, a, I think one spot that I need to touch up. But all in all, it looks really nice. It looks really nice.
Of course, I, I think I have the nosiest kitties in the world. They just have to check out every single thing that comes into the house. Every single project that I'm working on, they have to be a part of it. So, <laughs> excuse this kitty. So now I've trimmed off the, uh, the access and in the comments, let me know what you think. Um, was this project easy? Is this something that you may do? And thank you so much for watching and please subscribe. I, I would love to have you. Have a good evening.